Okay, just hurry. Hurry up, let's do this. Okay, let's not uh, judge one another on how we get certain things. We needed this ATM machine, so we had to go get it. And um, yeah, that's that. Are they bulletproof? We don't know. So let's say this is uh, against the wall. I'm gonna have to shoot it from the side because most case scenario, this thing will be mounted against the wall. So you can't go hide behind it this way. So you're gonna have to hide on the side like this if there is to be a, a shooting going on. So I'm gonna shoot it several times with different calibers to see what happens and uh, we'll go from there. Just ready, ready? Ready! Okay. All right, first round we're gonna do is just a nine millimeter, nothing fancy, just a full metal jacket, 115 grain. And I'm gonna use a Glock 17. Custom slide work done by Dynamic Weapon Solution, thanks to them, link in the description. All right, here we go. Clear. Okay. <laughs> Part of the jacket filled up. Ah, still hot. Not sure why I grabbed it. So there's a part of a jacket just on the ground, and that's from here, I think. <laughs> the lead is stuck in there. There's your lead. It didn't penetrate this area. So on the top, it looks like went in. And there's another panel I see from here. I don't know if you guys can see it. So it just went in through the first sheet metal. It stopped on the second one from the inside. This one went in a little bit deeper, I think. This one just stopped on the bottom. It didn't even go through. On the back side, there are no penetrations. So that's the first part. And then you have this little knob over here with codes. Great, I don't know the combination. <laughs> it was open, I think I locked it and... Oh man. Okay, so this was open at one point. I guess I locked it and I don't know the combination. That should say a lot. <laughs> and uh, we're gonna see if we can open it with the, uh, with the rifles maybe or something like that. I, I know the small calibers are not gonna do it. Anyway, that's that. The next round is gonna be with the Desert Eagle 44 Magnum and we're using these hollow points from Underwood Ammo, link in the description. Also shout out to Defender Body Armor for hooking these up. These are super lightweight uh, compared to the other metal plates that I got. Those things are heavy. I will leave a link in the description for their website. Thank you for sending me some body armors. They were super worried about me. <laughs> I think everybody is at this point and um, let's shoot it. Ready Just Petty? Ready! All right. Uh, Let's go one low, one medium, and one high. Clear. So one went through. We gotta check the back shortly. One kind of stopped. The other one kind of stopped on the second um, sheet metal on the back. And this one went right in. So let's see what happened on the back side. Oh man, they're not coming out. And that was a 44 Magnum. So still nothing is coming out of this thing. Even the top part, you would think it's kind of empty. It's just all computer stuff, but and this thing is super heavy. So there's a lot of metal in it. So these things will be a good idea to hide behind. Usually they are in the gas stations and stuff and a lot of crime happens in those kind of places. Uh, it'll be a good place to hide behind. Let's shoot it with the 762. Okay, now we're gonna do the AK round, the 762 by 39. We'll shoot it three times, same areas, bottom, middle, and high. Let's see what happens. That's pretty. Let's go a little further back on this one, just in case. All right. Ready? 
Ready? All right, here we go. Low. Middle. High. All three rounds went in. One, two, three. You got some jacket on the outside embedded in, inside this uh, sheet metal. Let's see what happened in the back. All right, so the bottom, before this thing got locked up, I remember the bottom and the bottom is really hollow. There isn't too much going on. There's a lot of metal here in the middle and I don't know what's on the top. It seems pretty solid, so. The bottom area, if you're hiding, open your legs like this and go like that. <laughs> Or crisscross your legs <laughs> so the bullet will just go between your legs like this. I guess this would be a good place to shoot back at, like this. Man, this is perfect. Yeah. So the AK round, the rifle round came out from the bottom. What do we have left? I don't know, 50. Yeah. <laughs> Not to go back and forth too much, I'm just gonna shoot them uh, all at the same time, three different rounds. We got a silver tip, this is armor piercing incendiary. We got a black tip, just the armor piercing. And this is a spot around. This one is not supposed to be really even good in penetrating, but we'll shoot it anyway and see what happens. I'll probably shoot this at the bottom since it's the weakest area, just to see some something happen, I don't know what. And these two, we'll shoot them on the top. All right, here we go. Got your ears covered? Yes. <laughs> that did it. The top opened. <laughs> Just buddy, can you focus in on that one? <laughs> Zoom it all the way in. You see it? Yeah. <laughs> Let's go in the middle now. <laughs> and low. And we are clear. Oh, why is it smoking like that? Oh, I don't know. Oh no. <laughs> There's smoke coming out from this hole. Oh, check this out. Oh, I guess there's paper in here. Maybe we got some money too. I don't think there's any money in it. So here's one of the 50 BMGs that got this to open. This is that, uh, spot around that I shot on the bottom. It went right through. This is the armor piercing incendiary in the middle. Looks like it went straight in. And of course that was the armor piercing one. On the back side, the AP came out from the middle. Even the spotter came out from the bottom. The largest hole. So this is a piece of the jacket. That's just the paper. More paper. So this is the only jacket that it's in there right now. It made a hole inside this thing, came right out. So the top part is the strongest, and so is the middle. Thanks to Griffin Energetics for sending these binary explosives to us. They're out of Canada. Thank you guys. It's even color coded, so it has blue, yellow, pink, so you can see it better. Oh, come on. Are you ready for this one? Ready! Let's go! Got your ears? Yes! Okay, mine too. We are hot! Fire hole! <laughs> Clear. All right. Nothing happened. Hmm. I'm going to shoot it three times with the um, 
with the armor piercing. I'm just gonna shoot it uh, random areas three times. See what happens. Let's buddy take your seat. Ready? Ready! Clear! Oh, nothing is going on. Nothing. Uh, at this point, I don't think I can get it open. I'm gonna have to stick around and make this video longer. I don't wanna do that. So we'll just finish the video here. They are bulletproof if you're not shooting with the 50 BMG. So you can hide behind those. It's a safe place in my opinion for most rounds. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and as always, thank you for watching. We'll see you guys next time.